I just wanted to say before this video starts that I know my room looks messy and I did that for a reason. I did it because I was showing that it's okay that not everybody is perfect and that, you know, not everybody has their shit straight together. So no hate comments for that, okay? Some people's lives are just like super busy and we don't always have time to do things like that. Hope you guys enjoy this video. What's up guys, it's Maddie, back with another YouTube video, and if you didn't read the title, and you just saw the thumbnail, because you know, sometimes I'd be doing that low-key, but basically, this video is a room tour. One of my lovely loyal subscribers gave me this idea because she said, or, I'm sorry, I'm not going to assume, they said that my room was very creative and cute and just like artistic-like, basically, and that gave me a good idea to do a room tour, so why not? If you guys haven't already, you should definitely go subscribe because like we're almost at 200 and like I've been saying, you guys get to pick that video for the 200 celebration. And yeah. Also, another video um, idea that I'd like to do is a Q&A. So if you guys have any questions that you want to ask, it doesn't matter what it is, bad or good, you can ask me and I'll literally record a video about it for you guys. So yeah, let's just get straight into this video. Okay, forgive me if the lighting is horrible and crappy and just all the negative mean words you could possibly think of. Please just bear with me, okay? I have three different lights in my room right now and trying to provide the most light I can. And there is literally no natural light outside. Otherwise, yeah. <laughs> But basically, this is the door to come into my room as you first walk in. And as you can tell, I love to color slash draw. Um, I do a lot of it. I consider myself a huge kid for doing it. But hey, it lets out some emotions that you just don't even know are being held. And it's just very relaxing and nice. I even have more on the outside of my door. My favorite one is that one. I completely forgot. And the new addition to the room from the... I don't even know my own videos at this point. But yeah, if you guys are watching my videos, I'm sure you know where that's from. And then right next to it is my nightstand where I keep all of my like books, my water bottles, um, some Pokemon cards that I have and like my makeup brushes, some essentials, obviously the Cheez-Its, some drinks, some random things like a measuring tape and a rag, all the good stuff, all the good stuff. And then once you like kind of like veer and go like that direction, I guess from my door is my cork board and I have some Pokemon cards, some more art. I loved doing this, but it took forever. Um, some family, some work-related things, a bracelet that I'm currently working on, some jewelry on top, the ring from the unboxing video. I still have to order new ring sizes. And fun fact, since I wasn't sure if the ring would fit my boyfriend, it was actually just a little bit too small. So I'm really glad that I got too small of a size instead of too big of a size. And then, as soon as you like just straight walk into my room is my bed my big old lonely futon bed. And as you can see, I have an obsession with um, stuffed animals. There's even more hiding underneath my blankets and stuff. But yeah, it's my big old lazy bed, my beautiful ring light. And then you walk like, cause this is how my floor is like designed. Forgive me for like being messy, but I mean, if you're not messy a little bit in life. Are you even like a human? That's my laundry basket. I try to hide it because you know, like nobody wants to see like dirty laundry in your room. So I'm trying to like hide it, <laughs> but I'm exposing myself today. So it's okay. Um, And then like, I have this wardrobe hanging thing. I don't know, but I hang all of my hoodies and all of my shirts on it. And I just love it because it takes up less room in my dresser. 
and then like right below it is a storage box that I got from storage and I'm about to see something that came from storage that I absolutely love a lot that made it my room a little bit more creative in my own way. My monster cans. Now listen, I did not drink all of these, okay? My boyfriend does supply some of them, a lot of them, because he has an addiction and I'm trying to get him to stop, but he doesn't listen to me. Um, <laughs> but yeah, as soon as you turn over, don't mind the trash, okay? I've been meaning to take it out, okay? Like, you know, life just gets really, really busy sometimes. Yeah, so as soon as you like turn over, there's some trash and then my backpack that I keep for school and my beautiful stitch wallpaper art thing. I love it. I love stitch a lot if you couldn't already tell by the stuffed animal on my bed. Then I got my calendar that I clearly love so much that I haven't updated in a, like a few days. <laughs> but then as soon as you turn is my dresser. And that's where I keep all of my artistic makeup, skincare, and hair things. I also clearly keep my ring light here. It usually goes right in front of the monster cans. So the monster cans are sometimes hidden, but not always. Those are like my little drawers of makeup and face skincare things and some perfumes, lotions, skin and hair care. Two beautiful pictures of me. This one was in elementary and this one, I have no clue when that was, but I was so little and so cute. My curly hair, I loved it a lot. But as you guys can clearly see, I don't really have the little ring lit curls that I used to have. They're just wavy, but that's if I braid it, which is what I did last night. But yeah, you guys got a little sneak peek of like my dresser and stuff like that from like the top. I have my clock, you know, the lamp. But then once you turn away from that, we have my beautiful, a beautiful shrine of my boyfriend of from his graduation party of the Get Ready With Me grad party edition, which you guys love that video. And I love you guys for loving that video. Someone literally commented this is the most realistic Get Ready With Me ever. And I would just love to say like, thank you. <laughs> but um, as you clearly can see, there's more monster cans that he loves to supply me with. So that's like his little shrine area that I recently did for him because you know, I just love him so much. And then we got my big old purse from the recent video. What's in my purse 2023? I just hang it on the door hinge. <laughs> and then you walk over is a closet but i don't use this closet because the people that live here they have all their stuff in there and i really don't mind because you know i don't use it i only like use it for a couple of things which i'll show you after i show you what's in here <laughs> but um basically this is just my shoe rack that i use and i do use it for shoes yeah this is just my shoe rack this is where i keep a lot of things like trash bags bingo supplies a lot of um nicotine devices in one pocket um some other gadgets and things like um my makeup you know some more chapstick i love chapstick literally that whole pocket is filled with like chapstick <laughs> and then also some like uh deodorant toothpaste something that i'm trying to give to my sister when i see her soon and then obviously my shoes down there i forgot about my fam but that's part of my room too but it's a fan, no one's really gonna miss it. And then, as soon as you go into this closet, it's just a whole bunch of stuff. And I'm sorry the lighting is gonna be terrible, but it's literally just like a suitcase and like a box of my things that like, I don't really like need anymore or it's just like storage type of stuff that I just don't really like use, you know? And a couple of hoodies and my fall jacket. But otherwise, that's just pretty much it for my little old room there's really not much to it but i love it it's my little cave besides the trash just like my life i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you didn't i'm really sorry either way you should definitely still like just give this video a like but anyways this is the end of the video thanks for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you subscribe make sure you like make sure you comment down below any youtube video ideas that you have for me or any questions that you may have for me about the Q&A that I'd like to possibly do. 
and I'm sorry for the delay of Minecraft videos that are possibly coming in the future, but I don't know yet because it's a little difficult right now since I don't have a mouse. It's really hard to play games without a mouse, so I'm trying to, you know, try to get that, but my life has been so busy and I'm just trying to make the best out of it. So yeah, I guess that's it guys. Love you so much. Bye.